okay now let's look at question number 13 part c of the 2024 combined mathematics paper right so here first we need to write root 3 plus i in polar form r cos theta plus i sin theta form right so we'll first do that then using the de Moivre's theorem we have to show an expression also right so first we'll find r r is going to be what r is going to be root 3 squared plus 1 squared or root square root of 4 so 2 so we have found that then we need to find the angle theta so we quickly draw this complex number in the argon diagram a rough di rough rough drawing of that so imaginary real so in this direction i want to go root 3 and then up 1 so that is our point root 3 plus i right then we want this angle theta because we know theta is what in the first quadrant right so using this triangle we can find tan theta tan theta is what tan theta is 1 over root 3 then that means theta is what uh, theta is pi over 6 right so then we have the correct form for root 3 plus i so r is 2 theta is pi over 6 right so first part is done then we are supposed to show using the de Moivre's theorem this expression is equal to 1 minus i so we'll start from uh, the left hand side and we know root 3 plus i to the 24th power so we'll use our polar form to get this number right so root 3 plus i is what that we found to be what 2 times cos pi over 6 plus i sin pi over 6 then 24th power of that number is going to be what 2 to the 24 and then apply the the Moivre's theorem so the angle is going to be what 24 pi over 6 plus i sine 24 pi over 6 right then simplify 2 to the 24 cos 4 pi plus i sine 4 pi right again now let's simplify this we know what uh, sine 4 pi is 0 cos 4 pi is 1 so that means what that means we have found this value for, the, for this number root 3 plus i raised to 24 is just 2 to the 24 right now what else do we need to do right okay we have to divide that by 2 to the 23 times 1 plus i right so root 3 plus i raised to 24 divided by 2 to the 23 times 1 plus i so from here we know the numerator is what 2 to the 24 then we have 2 to the 23 down and 1 plus i down then simplify we get what 2 on top then 1 plus i 
so then let's look at our result we need to show this is equal to 1 minus i right so what should we do multiply both the numerator and the denominator by 1 minus i then the denominator becomes what it just becomes 2 so 2's cancel and we get the result so that is equal to what that is equal to 1 minus i right so that is part c of question number 13 so next we will do question number 14